Hey everyone, it's Ken here from Northern Viking Everyday. Today I've got a quick Gmail tutorial for you. We're gonna be showing you how to send secure email in Gmail with a password. The recipient will need to input a code that gets texted to them in order to open it up and they will not be able to forward, copy, print, or download that email. It's really simple to do. So let's show you how to send confidential email in Gmail. All right, so I've got Gmail all loaded up here on my PC and we'll start out with showing you how to send the secure or confidential email. Then we'll jump over to the recipient account and show you exactly what it's like to receive the email and put in the password. So let's go ahead and compose an email here. I'll expand that and we'll put in the recipient's email address and we'll create a subject. This is a test. Now do keep in mind that anything you put in the subject line is not confidential. So don't put anything important there. In the body of the email, that's where we would put in the confidential information or as an attachment. So I'll just type something here. Have a wonderful day, just like that. So that part will be confidential. Now to make this a confidential or secure email, down here at the very bottom, you're gonna see a little padlock down here and when you hover over it it says toggle confidential mode we'll go ahead and left click on that and you'll get a pop-up that looks like this now do keep in mind that the recipient won't be able to forward copy print or download the email you're sending them now we can go ahead and set the expiration it defaulted to one week but we can set it to one day one week one month three months or five years and this is how long the recipient can open that email for i'm going to go ahead and leave that on one week and down here it says require passcode or your password and it says all passcodes will be generated by Google. So this is the password that gets texted to the recipient. And if you don't want a password on there, you don't have to use one. You can have no SMS passcode selected here and the recipient still won't be able to forward copy print or download that email. We want a passcode. So I'm going to go ahead and select that here on the right hand side. And then from there we can go ahead and hit save and we can send our email. You can see that it is secure right here. It gives you the little marking of that, but we'll go ahead and send that email. Now from here, it's gonna ask for the phone number of the recipient. So go ahead and select the country they're in. We're in Canada for myself, and then we'll go ahead and put in the phone number. And then from there, once you've got the phone number in, you can go ahead and hit send here and it's gonna finally send that email. Now let's jump over to my other account here and wait for that email to show up. And there it is there, we'll go ahead and open up that email. And you can see that the email is in confidential mode. You can see the subject, but again, you can't see the contents of the email. So right here, you'll see an option that says view the email. We'll go ahead and select that. And it's gonna show us that we need a password texted to the phone number we put in, a one-time passcode will be sent. We can go ahead and hit send passcode and it's gonna text me a password here. So that already showed up. Let's go ahead and have a look at it. I'll put that in here. And this passcode or password does change every time you do this. So it's not the same one down the road. Got that in there, we'll hit submit. And now it'll open up the email so we can have a look at it. And now we can see the portion that was in the body. Have a wonderful day. And again, we can't forward, copy, print, or download this email. Once you're done with it, you can go ahead and hit sign out here in the corner. And we'll go back here. And really it's that simple to send a secure email in Gmail and keep your email confidential. So hope this quick tutorial gave you value in sending confidential emails with a password. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also remember to subscribe here on YouTube. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, take care.